guys welcome back to my video i'm back again today with another interesting topic i want to say welcome to my new viewers welcome to my returning viewers and those of you my old viewers that constantly on my videos i want to say welcome if you are just coming upon this video oh don't just pass back don't just pass by subscribe hit that bell icon that's where you're gonna be notified whenever i upload a new video and also like my video share my video these are interesting topics that i bring out to you guys yes and you are free to leave me your comments in the comment section you know guys my channel is all about being informed inspired and motivated simply by boyner my name is boyner and this is my channel you are most welcome and today we are back again with another interesting topic yes Today, we are going to be talking about the seal of Liberia, and it's also called the coat of arm of Liberia. Some of us will see the seal of Liberia, but we don't know the meaning of it. We don't know what it is. We don't know what those things that are there. Why, why, why did they make it that way? Why they have to put this or that? What the meaning of the things, the, 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 the symbols that they put into this scene? What does it mean? So that's what we're going to know today. If you don't know, you're going to know today. So without wasting much of the time, guys, let's get straight into our topic. Yes. And we are talking about the seal of Liberia. Yes. You know, guys, I love to talk about my country, Liberia. Liberia is this tiny country on the west coast of Africa. And it's bounded by Guinea, Sierra Leone, Africa, and the Atlantic Ocean. Yes. Liberia had an election recently and they have a new president. Yes. So we are looking forward for new upgrade and more and more wonderful and beautiful things to happen in Liberia. Yes. And today, Liberia, we are going to talk about the symbol of Liberia that represents Liberia, the seal of Liberia, the coat of arm of Liberia. On top of the seal, you can see there, guys, they say, the love of liberty brought us here. And at the bel below of it, you see Republic of Liberia, yes, and there are things inside of the sea. We have coconut tree, we have sun, we have wheat parrot and shovel, we have a, a, a boat like a ship, we have a, a, a parrot, we have it. The parrot have something like a letter in its mouth. So, we are going to talk about these things. What does it mean? Yeah, why they have all of these things inside this one little bag? and box that is shaped like this so that's what we're going to talk about what is the meaning what is it about yes and it's about liberia it represents liberia yes and this seal of liberia it was it was adopted at the constitutional convention in 1847 this insignia it represents liberia when you have this seal bam it's liberia's Stem. Just like when you have your business, you have the stem. That's the symbol of your business. You write your letter, you sign on it. For we, 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 who our seal is our signature. Yeah, we are your signature. That letter or that information is not general. That document is not general. But with a country, the seal is their stem. Yeah, it's it. That was what make. The, the, the country official, that's what make every document, everything about that country to be official. Whether it's artifacts, it's documents, whatever it, it makes it to be important and genuine. Yes. So the seal is Liberia's stem. So if you have a document for Liberia, for those of you that are working in the 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 the, the the, the offices, the state, you see the seal. When there is a document that is to go out or that is from the country, you will have the country sealed on it. So you know that without that country seal, that document is not genuine. It's not from that country. Yes. So with the seal on a document, it makes that document to be genuine. It makes that document to be official. Whether it's document or it's anti it represents that country so the seal of liberia which is the coat of arm of liberia is what makes liberia to be official to be genuine to be important yes so without that 
nothing, no document, nothing about Liberia is official. Yes. Us about the funding of Liberia, yeah. How Liberia was funded, how the free slaves came, and those things, those artifacts, those things that they put into the seals. It's the whole seal tell us a story about Liberia, the funding of Liberia, it's the free slaves, how they came about, how Liberia was established. That's what the seal is telling us. That's how the seal was illustrated generally. Yeah. Yes, and it tells us about their journey. Like I said, there's a shape there. It tells us about their journey, how they came to this new land, to this new world, to this freedom land, to live again, to, to be free again, and live the way they want to live. So that's what it's all explained in that little illustration, that little diagram that goes like this. It just explains one beautiful story of freedom of new day, of thanksgiving, of happiness. Yes, let me put it that way. It shows various symbol of land and of the settlers coming into the country. In the sky of the seal, you see a dove a carrying a letter in the mouth. Then you see the sun rising over the horizon. And in the ocean, you see the sailing ship. You see the palm tree with plum and with spear at the base on the shore. And at the top of the sea, like I said, is the national motto of the country. We're going to talk about that in another video, which says the love of liberty brought us here. And beneath, it says the Republic of Liberia. And all of this symbol that is on the sea, it represents a meaning. And the, the ship that is in the sea, it represents the arrival of the settlers. It represents the ships that brought the settlers, the free slaves from America, from the, from the uh, Americas, from the Europeans to come to Liberia. Those were the ships. So the, 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 the put that ship there in that sea because people came from somewhere and settled in Liberia. And that's how Liberia was funded. Don't get me wrong, it's not that people were not in Liberia. We had the indigenous people in Liberia, but there were these settlers then that came that established Liberia. Today, now we now call the Republic of Liberia. Yes, so that's what the shapes represent. The palm tree represents the natural resources of Liberia. That's why you see the palm tree there. And then the shovel the, and the spears you see beside with the wheelbarrow beside the palm tree that are the instrument that they're going to use for the resources to develop the country. The sun that is rising in the horizon, it represents the new birth of a new country. Because then Liberia was born. And then the, the dove with the scroll in its mouth, it coming with communication. To say that we all can live together. We can live together as a country and coexist with other countries and have a peaceful community. So this was, was done before independence. So during that time, nobody was, was, was citizen. Liberia was not a country. There were indigenous people. There were other there were those slave people that were coming. So when the country was established, the seal, everything formed with all of those uh, instruments because the, the seal illustrate the coming of those slaves to settle in Liberia and a new birth and a new world. Yes, they brought about Liberia. They developed Liberia. They make Liberia into a country. Through, through them, Liberia got its independence and became a nation. So that was a new birth of a country coming into being. So that's what the seal and the, the represent, which is the symbol of Liberia. And it is the coat of arm of Liberia. So without that seal on any document that they say they document comes from Liberia or it comes from the state or it comes from the Republic of Liberia is not valid. Yes. So without that, that is the stem of Liberia. Without that, that document is fake. So today, this is what the seal of Liberia represents. It's very important. Without it, the country is, is, is not a country. Yes. So we should know that. We should understand that. And we should know when somebody says, oh, I have a document. Somebody says, oh, I'm from Liberia. Even on the passport, every document that comes from Liberia, that have Liberia, that come from the office and the state of Liberia, it has the seal, the coat. Watch out for that. If you haven't observed that, check for that. On your passport, on your ID, on your driver lesson, everywhere you're going to see the coat of arms in that document. Yes. So my beautiful people, this is what the seal 
of Liberia represent, the coats of arms represent all of those uh, symbols that are there, the palm tree, the wheel, the, the wheel, the, the spears, the, the shape, the dove with the shrew, all of them, it, the, the rising sun, all of them represent something. And that's why we're placed together that stands for the country like bureau so my beautiful people you can leave me your comment in the comment section you can add or you can subtract let's talk about our beautiful country like bureau and let's get to know more and more about this beautiful and wonderful country like bureau so guys you see What's on my head? If you love it, visit Boynton's collection. Yes, these bonnets that I have, you can use it anywhere. You can use it indoor and outdoor. I have it in different, different colors. Yes. Yes. So, guys, it's there. It's double sided. You can use it on both sides. It's double sided bonnet. You can use it on both sides and you can use it for outing and anywhere you want to use it. You want to use it to sleep. You want to use it out there. You can use it and it's called Boyness Collections website. Visit my website and shop for your bonus. I sell ladies and men accessory. Yes. Check out my website and don't forget to order when you get there. So I want to say thank you to all of my viewers. Thank you to all of my subscribers. Don't forget to leave me your comments and share my video and like my video. Please be liking my video as you watch it. Like it. When, when you just get in there, you just turn it up on my video, subscribe, like, and hit that notification bell and also share my video. So thank you there. See you on my next video. Have a good day, guys. I love you. Stay safe. Bye-bye.